Hi there, welcome back. So in this video I want to talk about group therapy. Um, if you watched my channel for a while now and watched my video on my experience in uh, being in a psych ward, you will know that while I was in a psych ward, like every day there was group therapy which um, they would reunite us all, like the people there, like, also depending on the age groups like kind of in a circle with a therapist there and which kind of like we would introduce ourselves so state our name, how old we are and kind of why we were there and uh, that was kind of my only experience in group therapy but the thing is that I kind of really liked it because in group therapy like I felt less alone even though kind of everybody had their own thing going on but it for the most part at least in that group therapy, it dealt with depression to some degree or still like anxiety maybe, not that much but issues that were not that different from mine they still were like I felt like most people had like more extreme things going on but you see like in group therapy that maybe in individual therapy you don't necessarily get is the experience that other people have gone through similar things that you have and I feel like that group therapy helps you feel less alone because even though the situation may be different kind of the sentiments and the feeling of feeling alone that people don't understand you kind of don't know what to do being afraid to open up and those kind of things kind of most people are even if my situation may be different, the emotion, the connection that you get in group therapy I think is still um, helpful even though it might not be the same as, you, as your experience and I just kind of like that um, close connection that you get with the people there and also just knowing that you're not alone in what you're experiencing feels like good because at least with depression or maybe also anxiety to some extent when you feel so alone, misunderstood you always feel like you're the only one who's feeling these emotions so actually seeing an actual person there not just one person but many others who share similar thoughts kind of usually gives you strength to keep on going and you can kind of back each other up and keep each other like um, get to know each other pe better, like keep track of each other and just help each other and encourage each other to do better so I like, so I like that aspect of group therapy and maybe you can, maybe not with everybody of course but with some people you can get to know them better and like form friendship of like of support and it might be like one or two people there that you might like better like would like to get to know better you can, can become friends with them and also friends or close people who understand you to that extent can be good sometimes um to kind of just express yourself when maybe you don't have group therapy or not able to have that anymore just staying in contact with these people who want to send you to that um, extreme or just to that degree which not everybody can always understand you I think it's a good idea and just a good thing to have that kind of closeness and support and um, it's so also like when I was uh, there in uh, the psych ward I did make some friends also that they don't really want you to stay in contact with other people once you get out and I think also yeah they mostly just uh, leave you in a first name like with no last name basis unless like there were more than two people there with the same name for the most part so you don't really you know, also like I got the phone number information from some of my from my roommate because she was one year younger than me and I did also make a video about her and where she also explained her experience in the psych ward and like uh, what she was going through and everything but 
I feel like I really benefited from our friendship because we were similar in different ways and just a type of connection when you're just in a in a bad state or just about testing your life where everything is kind of all downhill can it really help if someone who's also not in the best place I feel like who can maybe like understand you better than people who they may know you other people but not to that extreme I would feel like or like they understand you from an outside perspective but I feel like at times the people who are there with you see every day like what you're going through and like in group therapy you have to be honest and open kind of with your worries and what is going on I like that because you can kind of just really be honest with how you feel and for the most part people there understand you, don't judge you while at, at times I feel like in the in society nowadays or just in the outside world you feel like you worry a lot how other people might react to what you're saying and also worry that they may not understand you but that but I feel like in the cycle in that and in that kind of environment I felt safe to be able to express myself and the people there were there to help me and just kind of felt like a nice safe place maybe not everybody has that experience even though this video is supposed to be relating to group therapy for my experience it also has to deal with my experience in the psych world because that's actually the only experience I have with uh, group therapy so um, I want to say also if maybe you have the, the not the experience, the chance to try out the group therapy I would suggest it, I don't really know uh, outside of the psych world where like, you have, can get the group therapy but I think there are places available I don't know for me personally or like where to go but maybe if you try to reach out and ask or maybe ask your psychiatrist or therapist they might know so I think that's just a good idea for people to have if they need to and just fix like that so that's kind of what I want to talk about the benefit of group therapy is to help you feel um, to open up and if, if you are born more so people actually listen to you you know also if a therapist they listen to you of course but maybe in a therapist you may get in your head that even though they are there to help you uh, knowing that also other people like you around your age you feel the same way might be a better way to connect and feel um, mm, that you listen to better and in that kind of situation so that is what I wanted to talk about today if you have any questions about group therapy or my experience you can leave a comment down below if you want to watch more of my videos you can subscribe stay tuned you can like this video if you like what I talked about and see you next time whenever I upload another video okay bye